Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about what is a weighted moving average. Now, the weighted moving average is used in technical analysis and financial data. Now, when it comes to the weighted moving average, what you're doing is different data values will carry with themselves different weights. And in a weighted moving average, when you're adding those values, the weights will decrease in arithmetic progression. In other words, the weights will be less and less as you add progressive values. So here's the formula associated with that, and we'll go from there. So the weighted moving average is WMA, and you have the subscript M. There's going to be a lot of subscripts in this particular formula, so just uh, keep that in mind. So you're going to have in the numerator P sub M plus, or actually N P, N P sub M plus N minus 1, P sub M minus 1, and you're going to keep on adding until you get to plus 2P sub m minus n plus 2, and then one more term, plus p sub m minus n plus 1. All that over n plus n minus 1 plus all the way down plus 2 plus 1. Now the denominator will end up being a triangular number, but the bottom line is when you plug in the different data values and their corresponding weights, you should be good to go in finding the weighted moving average. So I'm Jimmy Chang and that's how to do the weighted, what is a weighted moving average.